am excited today to introduce a brand new free Etsy tool that will simplify how you find keywords. Etsy stats feel kind of limited and you have to dig in several different places, but when you go ahead and connect up to Google Analytics, it feels like you need a research grant to understand what's going on. Am I the only one? Well, clearly not, because eRank has created a brand new tool. With this, we are able to see at a glance the keywords that are working for paid and organic traffic. Check your SEO to see if there are any potential improvements you can make to your titles and tags. And even get some Pinterest and Facebook data. I am already excited about this tool, but it can only get better once you guys start to use it and give eRank feedback. So don't forget to join the Facebook group and get involved in the discussions. So let's get started. The data from this comes directly from Google Analytics, so you need to connect your Etsy shop to Google Analytics. If you have already done this, then great, Google is already collecting your data for you. But if you haven't done this yet, my friend Starla has created a video walking you through step by step how to set this up. Google just recently, I mean last week, changed how this happens, so her video is actually the most up-to-date one, and she explains things really well. Once this tool is live for you on your eRank account, you'll see this on your dashboard. A traffic stats section. Hit that setup button and eRank will walk you through giving eRank access to your Google Analytics. And don't worry, your data here is private to only your account. So you have to sign in with Google and pick your Google tracking ID to link to. You may have Google Analytics connected to other blogs and websites, and the eRank tool is only useful with your Etsy shop, so make sure and pick the tracking number for your Etsy shop. Google will probably email you with a warning to let you know that eRank has connected. This is just for your security and nothing to worry about. They do this every time something new connects up, just in case it wasn't you. Then eRank can fetch your data for you. Be aware that Google can only start getting you data from the day you link your Google Analytics to your Etsy shop. So if you've just connected up, there'll be no data yet, but come back tomorrow and you'll start to see some data. Now we can see your top keywords words. These are the search terms that buyers have put into the Etsy search and clicked on your items when they've seen them in the search. Already this is great to see right at a glance what keywords are actually bringing customers to your shop. But you want to see more? Okay then. You can click the see more button here or from any page on eRank go to shop traffic stats. Here you will see your keywords for the time period you've selected. You can change that time period here. Now remember to pick a large enough time period that you get a lot of data. The more data you have, the more accurate it is. If you've just connected recently or only have a small amount of data, you can still have fun here, but be careful of drawing too many conclusions with just a small amount of data. It's interesting and helpful, but certainly don't change your entire shop based on it. You can filter here by typing in parts of your keyword phrases. For example, if you wanted to see all keywords you were found that contain the word corgi or cat or bookmark, visits are the amount of times people clicked on a listing they saw for that keyword. Position on Etsy is the average of where they saw your listing. A high number means you're ranking low in search. And this might tell you there's room to optimize more for that keyword to get seen even more. When you click on any of the keywords, you see all the listings that were found for that keyword and the data is broken down for that listing as to whether it was seen in normal organic search or for the Etsy ads. The yellow highlights you're seeing in the title and tags are showing where the keywords are actually in your title and tags. If you saw, for example, a keyword of yours was ranking low in search, a high number in search, and you didn't have that keyword in your title, if the listing wasn't performing all that well, you could go and add the keyword to your title. But be aware never to change listings that are performing well, even if you feel they can be good. This could be an idea to make another listing to try and compete for that keyword. If you click on an individual listing here, it shows you all the keywords that listing is being found for in organic and in ad search. You can also see the times it was clicked on Facebook and even some of the pins on Pinterest it was being found with. Note, the data here on Google Analytics is fairly limited, so let us know if you find this helpful. I know already this is an exciting update, but wait! 
there's more. With Google Analytics, E-Rank is able to add even more features to one of my favorite tools, Spotted on Etsy or the Monitor tool. If you go into other keywords now, you don't just have the keywords on our system, the E-Rank Monitor, the keywords yourself and other E-Rank users put into E-Rank, but you also see the keywords that actual users on Etsy have used and found your listings. You can see the time, the keyword, the listing, and the position it was seen for. E-Rank is also using this data to update some other tools. Check out your listing audit on some of your listings and see some of that extra info. Now this tool is going to be available to everybody. Some restrictions might apply to the free accounts, but if you have a paid account, remember you will also be able to add any of the keywords that you discover through this by hitting the star and they'll be saved to your keyword lists. If for whatever reason you want to disconnect your Google Analytics from your E-Rank account, that's also really simple. Just go to your settings page and scroll down and disconnect from your shops. Everyone at E-Rank is really excited about this tool, but we can only grow and improve it with your feedback. So don't forget to let us know in the group or email support at erank.com. Now remember, although I also work for Erank, videos in this channel are my own and I'm not being sponsored to say what I'm saying. I will not talk about things that I don't believe in, but I am genuinely excited about this tool and I think you will be too.